back to my series, The Bible Doesn't Make Any Sense. Today's episode, Genesis chapter 32, verses 22 through 32. This is the story of Jacob wrestling with God. Now, I had to go all the way back to Genesis 25 to get the context on who Jacob was. And even with the context, I still don't understand why this happened. That's just for those people that are going to be like, well, you're reading it out of context. I read the context and I still don't know what the fuck is going on. To keep it brief, Jacob had a twin brother named Esau. Jacob did some pretty fucked up shit to his brother. Jacob not only took Esau's birthright, but he also took his blessing that Esau was supposed to receive from their father. And when Jacob took Esau's blessing, he went away for a long time, found a couple of wives, had like 11 kids. So this story is happening while Jacob is waiting to see his brother Esau again after all of these years. One night, Jacob sent his wives, all of his kids, his servants, he sent all of them away for the night. So he was alone. While Jacob was left alone, a man wrestled with him until daybreak. It doesn't say anything about where this man came from, about them having a conversation, none of that. It's just Jacob sent his people away and now he's wrestling with this dude. Until the man finally said, let me go, it's daybreak, we can stop now. And Jacob replied, I'm not letting you go until you bless me. The man asks him, what is your name? Jacob gives the man his name. Then the man says, your name will no longer be Jacob, but Israel, because you have struggled with God and with humans and have overcome. So the man that he was wrestling with was God? Jacob asks him, can you just tell me what your name is? And the man replies, why do you want to know my name? And then he blesses Jacob. And it never says where the man went or what happened to him. This shit is starting to sound like Cotton Eye Joe. Where did you come from and where the hell did you go? So Jacob calls the place Peniel, saying it's because I saw the face of God and yet my life was spared. And then the chapter just basically ends. When chapter 33 starts, it's Jacob about to meet with his brother Esau. I just, what? What the fuck just happened? What?